I have been authorized by the Department of Justice to confirm that the FBI, as part of our counterintelligence mission, is investigating the Russian government's efforts to interfere in the 2016 presidential election. And that includes investigating the nature of any links between individuals associated with the Trump campaign and the Russian government, and whether there was any coordination between the campaign and Russia's efforts. Uh, as of today, Admiral Rogers, do you have any evidence that Russia cyber actors changed vote tallies in the state of Michigan? <clears throat> No, I do not, but I would highlight we are in foreign intelligence organization, not a domestic intelligence organization. So it would be fair to say we are probably not the best organization to provide a more complete answer. How about the state of Pennsylvania? No, sir. The state of Wisconsin? No, sir. State of Florida? No, sir. The state of North Carolina? No, sir. The state of Ohio? No, sir. So, that, so you have no intelligence that suggests or evidence that su suggests any votes were changed? I have nothing generated by the National Security Agency, sir. Director Comey, do you have any evidence at the FBI that any votes were changed in the states that I mentioned to Admiral Rogers? No. In an effort to explain why there was no evidence supporting the President's claim that Obama had wiretapped him, the President and his spokesman, Sean Spicer, have suggested that British intelligence, mm. through its NSA or GCHQ, wiretapped Mr. Trump on President Obama's behalf. Did you ever request that your counterparts in GCHQ should wiretap Mr. Trump on behalf of President Obama? No, sir, nor would I. That would be expressly against the construct of the Five Eyes Agreement that's been in place for decades. And the Five Eyes are some of our closest intelligence partners, and Britain, Britain is one of them. Yes, sir. Have you seen any evidence that anyone else in the Obama administration made such a request? No, sir. And again, my view is the same as Director Comey. I've seen nothing on the NSA side that we engaged in any such activity, nor that anyone ever asked us to engage in such activity. And if you were to ask the British to spy on American, that would be a violation of U.S. law, would it not? Yes, sir. Our relationship with British intelligence is one of the closest we have with any foreign services. Isn't that true? Yes, sir. Now, the British allies, our British allies have called the president's suggestion that they wiretapped him for Obama nonsense and utterly ridiculous. Would you agree? Yes, sir. Investigating it and having proof of it are two different things. You look at the acting Obama CIA director said that there is smoke, but there is no fire. Senator Tom Cotton, not that I'm seen and not that I'm aware of. Uh, you look at Director Clapper, not to my knowledge. Senator Chris Coons, Democrat from Delaware, I have no evidence of collusion. I mean, there's a point at which you continue to search for something that everybody who's been briefed hasn't seen or found. Um, I think it's fine to look into it, but at the end of the day, they're going to come to the same conclusion that everybody else has had. So you can conti continue to look for something, but continuing to look for something that doesn't exist.